Our laboratory was the first in the world to identify cannabinoid receptors within the immune system. Michigan State University researcher Norbert Kaminsky is studying the role cannabis plays in improving brain health in HIV patients who often experience mental decline due to brain inflammation. We find that medical marijuana may help to either impair that inflammatory process that leads to neurocognitive impairment or may actually be able to stop it. This research happens in collaboration with MSU physician Dr. Peter Gulick who treats the HIV patients in this study. Patients like coming to the clinic here because they know that there's research involved with it and it's not just a clinical program. With Dr. Kaminsky's help, hopefully we'll find reasons why this is occurring and maybe some solution as to how we can better treat it and improve the quality of life of the um, HIV patient. The work that Kaminsky and Gulick are doing to understand the relationship between cannabis use and improve brain health in HIV patients may be used to treat other diseases. So inflammation is a very important component of many different neurodegenerative disorders such as Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and we hope that the work we're doing with HIV patients may also be useful or applicable to the treatment of individuals that have these other diseases.